Welcome back to more Pokemon Moon, everybody. So last time we um, went through like a very boring sequence in the end of like just fighting the same freaking Pokemon like three times in a row. But eventually it got, you know, pretty fun because we did fight the Totem, the giant electric bug. Whatever. Wait, what am I doing? Oh crap. I wasn't paying attention. Shoot. Um, let me actually go back in here and talk to these people again. Mally Garden? Okay, sure, let's go. Wherever the hell that is, because um, I forgot. I'm pretty sure it won't be that bad, though. I just need to leave this place. I'm in Mount Hokulani. Mount Hokulani, wait, what the hell? Oh, shoot. Okay, I definitely need a heal. I am in a terrible state right now. One fainted, one paralyzed, one and a half health. Oh, Jesus. Those totems did that to me? Seriously? Damn, were that, I mean, those Pokemon and that totem? It was like four battles, but I'm pretty sure I did some other battles, right? I don't know. I don't remember. It's been a couple days since I last recorded. Because as you already know, I tend to record um, videos and sessions. Like three in a row or something, and then I take like a day off. And then I get back to it again, you know? That's pretty much the routine. Oh, I haven't gone down this mountain yet. This means there might actually be items here if I uh, approach this correctly, so you know what? I'm gonna use a super repel. Because I can. You can't stop me. <laughs> Whatever. Alright, Tauros. Let's see. Oh, look at that. TM72 Volt Switch. That's the electric equivalent of U-Turn. 70 power. Physical. Um, and you basically switch Pokemon as soon as you use that. Yeah. I also need to, like, ex okay, nothing over there. I was like, I need to explore. Oh, not really. Okay, that's cones. That's cones. Here's another item. That's a fastball. Where's the curveball? <laughs> Stupid joke. Whoa, trainer? You. You're a trainer, dude. I mean, I guess I could have come down here first before that totem thing, and I guess it would have made things a little bit easier, because that would have given me a couple more levels, possibly, but oh well. Boldor. Okay, that is a pure rock type. Not good because I'm a bug type. I probably need a switch. Hmm. Yeah, let's go to bring a donkey. You're gonna resist rock types and you're gonna be super effective because you are, of course, a ground type. Oh, a mud slap. Really? Why did you use that move? I don't know. Now the problem is, um, I'm gonna probably miss here. Do it. Nope, I didn't. High horsepower. Bam. Oh, you've gotta be- oh, that's uh, sturdy, okay. Yeah, I think Boulder actually is also known for having really high, um, defense, though. Like, Gigalith, you know, Gigalith has like 140 base defense or something? Or maybe 130, I don't know. Something like that. Oh, damn, I didn't miss. That's great. That's awesome. Alright, so that's one down. Perfect. Geodude. What is that? What in the hell is that? That is not a Geodude. Well, I mean, it's a Geodude, but that's a... What the heck? You know what sucks? This guy also has Sturdy. Because you either have Sturdy or Rockhead. But he's gonna have Sturdy. I knew it. That fucker. God damn it. Okay, I can tell that you're not a pure rock type though. Like, you can't be. You're something else. I mean, you're rock something. Yeah, I'm switching to the 100 accuracy in this situation because it's 100 versus 95. So, that could help a little bit more because I'm mud slapped twice, you know? So it's gonna be at least a small, minor improvement, you know? In accuracy. Alright, so you're down. Down and out. Very straightforward. Oh, look at that. Uh, yes. Here's another one. That is a heavy ball. Anything over here? No. Anything over here? I'm just, like, mashing the A button. Okay, why well, didn't the little thing appear? Of, like, a trainer nearby? 
I didn't think it was a trainer because I didn't think like it didn't show up until I actually talked to him. Then the exclamation mark came out. I was like, what the hell? Okay, Pissimian. I don't know what the hell that is. What is that? You look part fighting? I'm gonna use Draining Kiss. Yep, super effective. Take down. Take that recoil damage. Okay. Yeah, so whatever you are, um... Well... <laughs> you're weak to fairy. So I'm assuming you are part fighting then. Or maybe pure fighting, I don't know. But that's also why they didn't use my bug attack. Okay. Heavy slam. Sure. What the hell? The user slams into the target with its heavy body. The more the user outweighs the target, the greater the move's power. Interesting. Very interesting. Now let's see. Steel is super effective against Fairy. Rock. But I already have high horsepower and low sweep for that. Um, also, Ice. I already have low sweep. And Rock Tomb. And... What else? Rock... Ice. Is that it? That might actually be it. And Fairy, of course, but... The hell? You know what? Sure, let's go ahead and get rid of this. I haven't used Iron Defense a single time yet, I've noticed. And that's because I'm really letting my Stamina ability use the defense bonuses, not really Iron Defense. Oh, damn. That's an evolution of the previous guy, right? Whoa, that was normal damage right there. Nasty plot, that ain't good. Okay, um... Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Um, let's use Bug Buzz. That was actually super effective. I don't know your typings, but I... Wow. You look like the other dude. How, how can the other one, like... What the heck? I really need to take a look at that. I really do, because I have no idea what typing you actually are. Let's take a look at that right now. Okay, um... Wait, what? I'm not even here, dude. You're not in any of these. Okay, that's weird. I don't know what that means. Let's just go to the Alola Pokédex. Was I right about this typing, by the way? I was. It's Bug Electric. Okay. I can't find you. Interesting, so this guy's actually a hmm, pure rock type, being the evolution of Rock Rough. I didn't know that. Okay. Wishy washy, that, shelter, what the hell is this? Poison water, makes sense, okay. Holy Pup, Bagon, no, oh, no, no. Okay, what are these again? Grass Fairy. That's not, see, I thought it was a poison. That's why I was so wrong about that. Okay, dude, I seriously can't find- oh, there, there you go. You're a fighting type. No, how do I go to the next one? Dude. Oh, wait, that's the first of a- wait, what? No, actually, they're- what the hell? Does one of them evolve into the other? I mean, usually that- that's true, if what the heck? Normal Psychic to a pure fighting type. That is weird. Okay, I mean, if you say so. Wait, I can jump down here. That's a max potion, I'll take it. Sure. And there's more ledges. I don't really care about that. Oh, damn. I turned back up a little bit just to see if I missed anything, but I'm pretty sure I didn't. Nope, I did not. Okay. Let's 
So I made it all the way down? Really? Okay, I... Nope. And then he got a Taurus. I don't know where that leads. Can I just, like, run past you? Really? No. Oh my god, I'm actually stuck here. I need to go wherever you're gonna take me. Sure. Okay. I mean, I'm here. As I was saying, apparently I need to go all the way back to the beginning area. I saw that the berries respond, but I don't really care. Route 10, Route 11. Can I actually go down here? Oh, I actually can. Only thing is, I'm not sure. What, what the hell? Oh wait, I need to go over there. I just saw it. Hello, Professor Cuckoo. Oh my god, it's Team Skull again. Oh, these guys. Four turns, huh? Oh man. He's gonna demolish you guys, Team Skull. Fine, you asked for it. Hmm. What the hell? Who are you? A bigger punk. It's Guzma. The boss has graced us with his presence. Okay, uh, um, you need some help, Professor Kukui. Greetings, cowering public. We have an exciting bat for you tonight. In the opposing corner, the Pokemon Professor Kukui. And in this corner, the boss of Team Skull and the hardest guy around, Guzma. Oh my god, dude. Oh man. The captains, the kahunas. You chose not to. I mean, interesting, like, the whole idea of establishing a Pokemon League, because, like, I've always wanted to, like, know where exactly it is that, um, or, like, how Pokemon Leagues were established in the first place in each of the regions, right? That's right. Hmm. He's loving every minute of it. Shining his ri Ribombi. Ribombi. Okay, let's battle. Let's battle, dude. A Z-Ring, yep. What's the point of it? It'll make me strong. That's what I want to find out. No, it won't, you dumb kid. Watch closely, Kukui. Okay. Guess we must fight. Me versus Ramza. Ramza. I mean, Goose. Why did I say Ramza? Oh, I, I know why I said Ramza. It's actually very. Not related. Oh god. Okay, you're a bug. Bug something. But you also look like part steel, honestly. You really do. Oh crap. This ain't good. I'm gonna use Stun Spore. At least we didn't miss. That's good. I don't know what you are. Are you part steel? You look like bug steel. Sword Stance. That is not good. Okay, I'm gonna try Bug Buzz just to kind of see. Engage you. That was normal damage, which means you're not part steel. Emergency exit. Are you those? Okay, this one's a bug poison. Uh, which means... Oh, crap. Switch. Let's bring out... Let's bring out Disney, sure. Yeah, so you're a bug user. I mean, I can kind of tell because you have Ariados and then the other goalie, whatever the hell. Shadow Sneak, haha, <laughs> that's funny. Okay, let's go ahead and get a Pluck. 
I wasn't sure if I should do that or Beat Blast. But the thing is, Plug might not actually kill you though. No data did. I need to start trusting your attack stat more because I noticed that your attack stat like skyrocketed. It's your speed that went down. Okay. Um, just to be safe, actually, you know what? I think here's this bug. I think here's this bug. Yep, you are. Well, I mean, you might be bug something else, but I mean, the point is that you're not a part type that resists bug and or flying. Look at that, attack 106. A drill pack! Yes, I was waiting for that move. Because you beat blast here. Although it's powerful, you know. It's essentially a decreased priority, but the drill pack, it's a basic power 80, which means it can replace pluck. Alright, now this guy is set with the stab moves. Oh my god. I mean, he needs to learn a powerful normal type attack, too. Alright, I beat you, man. Damn. It was shiny, right? I'll remember you. As someone I'll be happy to beat down anytime. What do you mean anytime? You already failed once. Why, thank you. Thank you very much, dude. <laughs> Soul shaking. What are you gonna give me? The evolution of the Lin you chose. Incinium Z. Okay. Malayan gave you, yep. Here, take it. Take the mask. Oh, look, there's Lily. Ace Rolla. That was probably at the Malasada shop. Yeah, no, they're, they're kind of scary group, but they're pretty pathetic, actually. Mount Lanakilla. Oh, I will. I will keep training, dude. I will keep training to become stronger and more powerful. Okay, pass route 11. Sure, I'll go there. Goodbye, Lily. Goodbye again for the 10th time in this Let's Play. Oh, I can't use Tauros. I don't know why. Now I can use Tauros. Okay, let's go. We're gonna make it to Route 11. Oh boy. Alright, let's spam them repels. We gotta do this. Because there might be some stuff on his eyes. You never know, right? You never know. Okay, what's over here? Here's an item. A big mushroom. Good start, good start. Oh, you're not a trainer. What about you? Oh, thank you. Thank you for that heal. I really appreciate that. Okay, there's a trainer right over there. The path splits there, but I will fight you. Ooh, doubles battle. Doubles. Double battle, doubles battle. You know, are there like no triple battles in this game? Because in Alpha Sapphire there were not, but in Generation 5 is when they got introduced, right? Although, like, they just kind of like stopped using them. They still use Swarm Battles a little bit in Gen... Well, Gen 6 off of Sapphire, you know, but... I don't know. And in here they have those freaking battles where, like, they call for allies, which is very annoying. Hurtier. So Hurtier is the evolution of, I believe it's Lillipup? Which evolves into Stoutland. Okay, so it's a pure normal type, I think. Um, I'm gonna use... Oh, great. You know what? I'm just gonna use a Bug Buzz. On Erdier, and I'm gonna use a Drill Peck on Fletchinder. You know, I think the evolution of Fletchling becomes a um, part fire. I think it's like fire flying. But I don't know if it's in its second evolution or its third one. Peck? That's not gonna do too much damage. All right, there we go. That's gonna be for the kill and get some HP. That's right, get some HP, man. There we go, got you. All 
Alright, pretty good experience, 558, 558 split, and of course the rest of my team, well, look at that, green is now level 31. That is so amazing, green is catching up. Green feels like it's catching up, you know? I mean, I'm not going to be using green in too many battles except certain situations where a defensive Pokemon is very good. Because as you can tell, I have pretty much all offensive Pokemon except green. Oh, hello, dude. What are you doing? You're not even looking at me. You're not even looking at me. That was weird. That was extremely weird, but whatever. Preschool. There's seriously preschooler Pokemon dreams? Oh my god. Stuffle, what the hell is that? You look like a Care Bear. Or like a Build-A-Bear or something. I don't know what the hell you look like, but something weird. Um, let's try Bug Buzz. I don't know what typing you are. That one did... Wait, oh, I was like, what? Not very effective, but it was a critical hit, so it offset to normal damage, and I beat you like that. Okay, level up. Dazzling Gleam? Sure. The user damages opposing Pokemon by emitting a powerful flash. Power 80. Oh man, you know what? Forget this move, Draining Kiss. I know I have two bug type attacks though, and I really need to not do that. Um, bug Buzz by itself is really good. I like Bug Buzz more than the other one. But, yeah, I mean, we'll see. You know what I should do though? I do need to just start making like more type coverage for my Pokemon. Um, I'm gonna put Bug Buzz first because I'm using Bug Buzz a lot more than Pollen Puff. Let's also just, uh, let's see here. So Dazzling Gleam second, and then, yeah, I probably need to replace Pollen Puff, honestly. Got a Drill Peg, Brick Break. What the hell? It's not working. Okay, there we go. Darkest Lurk at power 85. Okay. And then yeah, you have Leech Life, of course. I haven't even used Bulk Up yet, really. Okay. I'm doing pretty good for now. Um, Bug Buzz, Dazzling Gleam, Pollen Puff. Well, I, mean, I don't know what else you can learn, though. Let's go to Bag and see what moves I can actually use. Hidden Power? No, that's too weak. I don't want that. Sleep Talk? No. I'm just looking at what he can actually learn. Leech Life? Nope. Not going to teach you that. Double Team, Low Sweep? No, no, no. You can learn Psychic. That is real interesting. You know what? I'm going to teach you Psychic. Because Psychic would be good against Poison. And that's one big disadvantage that you keep yeah, running into. So you know what? Yeah, I'm actually going to teach you Psychic. Get rid of that. That's uh, better typing coverage. Good against poison. Good against fighting too, but I mean, that's already fairy type, so it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Oh, I need to go around here. Gyro Ball, that's a steel type attack. Does more damage the difference of speed that you have versus the opponent. Like, the slower you are, I think, or something, compared to the opponent. Okay, so that's all there's there. Also, what are my levels? You're 35, but I'll just keep using you for a little bit more. I'm okay. I'm okay with that, you know? What? There's a dude doing push-ups there. It's weird. Oh, wait, there's an item there, too. What the hell? I didn't even see that. Another big mushroom. <sighs> I don't want to use a repel just for this. Get the thing. Quick ball. Okay, at least I got the item. I'll probably get into one encounter. Oh, I didn't. Hello, trainer. You look like a fighting type user, but that's okay because I got my fairy typing. And also my psychic now. Hariyama. Okay. Hariyama being a pure fighting type. Yeah, so the move that I just learned, Dazzling Gleam, that was, um, was that 80 or 85 power? It was, let's take a look. It was 80, okay. So 
So that's 80 stabbed, that's 90 non-stabbed, so Dazzling Gleam actually does more damage. So let's use Dazzling Gleam. There we go. Oh, critical hit. I don't know if that would have one-shotted you. I would assume so. I mean, it has a lot of HP, Hariyama, but its defenses are not that good. Because it has really good HP and really good attack. But all the other stats of Hariyama are pretty bad, which is why it tends to balance itself out, you know? Oh, damn. Who are you? Greetings, Shogower. Hello there. Oh, thank you. Thank you for opening whatever that, that gate is that you're talking about. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it, right? Let's go. Through the captain's barricade. Okay, what is this? We're 12. We are just progressing like crazy. Okay, let's go back to Tauros. Oh, great. Another cutscene. You again? Hello, Hapu. Okay. Another one. <clears throat> it was remiss of me not to register her for you when we met one another in Mali. Okay. Wait, so what's the ability, though? I'm not really sure. Okay, what's the point of... What? What's the point of Mudsdale? Like, what he can do? I'm a little bit confused here. Oh, can run over rocky terrain. Only thing is, though, he's super fucking slow. I mean, Tauros... Oh, shit. Tauros is much faster, I'm just saying. Oh, that terrain, huh? That's not muddy terrain. That's rocky terrain, is it not? Okay, sure, I'll battle every other trainer on Route 12. Huh. That's funny. Oh, damn, don't run through the grass. I don't think I have a repel on, do I? Pretty sure I don't. That's a burn heal. Okay. Oh my god. Just love the way he just moves so slowly. There are like no trainers here, dude. Like, that guy's like, beat every trainer in this route. Well, guess what? There's none. Oh, there's you two. Oh, there's these punk people that look like Team Skull people. Alright, Punk Pair, Yoko, and yeah, whatever. Weird names, I know. Okay. Pancham and Crocorock. Alright, so the one over there is a. I think it's just ground? Oh shit, I don't know. Mold Breaker. Hey, I haven't seen anybody since Rampardos having that ability. Okay. I'm gonna. You look like a fighting as well. I'm gonna try Dazzling Gleam. Oh, that has both. Okay, that's perfect. Um. I'll try Drill Peck on you. All right, let's see what happens. Dazzling Gleam. Whoa! You kill them both. You kill them both. Horny. Damn. You are so powerful. That was powerful. Okay, I mean I'll take it. Sure. Hey, look another another thing here. Um, you know, I need to go back actually. I'm pretty sure there's something over here. Because I'm looking at the map and it seems like this way's a dead end. Which implies that most likely there's something over here that I can... Oh, what? Oh, crap. Yeah, I need to run through here in person. Okay, can I... Dude, I could have just gone through there. I'm an idiot. Okay. That was a very long vision. Big line of sight. Okay. Rising star Lilani. Lilani. Alright, cool. Tortu Tortuga. It's like Tortuga in Spanish. Alright, so you're a water something. Um, doesn't really help me much though. I'm just going to go ahead and use my strongest stab and that's Bug Buzz. And I also have Solar Powder. Oh, st stupid sturdy. Everybody has sturdy. Oh no. Oh, damn it. You're probably rock water. 
Okay. One of the biggest problems now, though, is that I actually cannot heal by using my little draining move, you know? Because I switched it with Dazzling Gleam. Okay, at least you're fainter now. Look at that, Disney 35. That's nice. Okay, so let's see, there are... Can I go this way? Yes, I can. Here's an item. Elixir. But yeah, there are two ways to go, so I already got that one with the elixir, and now this pathway, which leads to... A sign. Island scan. Okay. Where does this... Oh, damn, that's just a shortcut. I don't want that. Geothermal power plant and Route 13. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, let's bring it back to you. Okay. I'm almost out of time, by the way, so this will probably be the last battle here. Let's see. Who is the enemy? And it's a Kranidos. That is a pure rock type. Alright, so you're going to have Mole Breaker, not Sturdy, and you have actually really bad stats except for attack, which means I can pretty much kill you. In one shot. There we go. Simple enough. Yeah, I actually really liked Rampardos, because when I play Diamond, and I play Diamond a lot, trust me, I um I loved Rampardos. Its attack is just so massive, you know? And I love that. Hyper Potion. Sweet. Alright, I believe that about covers that whole section there. Um because I'm about to go into a new route if I keep going either way now, you know? Although I just need to finish up this route to see if... That is a trainer. That'll be for next time, so if you enjoyed this episode in any way, please be sure to leave a like. I'd appreciate that very much. Thank you, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a good day.